Hey YouTube, this is Primetime Pokemon. In this video, I'll be opening up a Breakpoint Pokemon Booster Box. Now this Booster Box opening is part of my 20 Pokemon Booster Box opening series that I'm doing on my channel for the summer of 2018. I did purchase this Booster Box from Troll and Toad for $84.99. The Breakpoint set is one of the older sets in the 2018 standard format and will be rotated out later this month. The set is based around Shiny Gyarados as well as Mega Gyarados and is a very good set for building water type decks, specifically Greninja and Greninja Break. So here's a look at the booster box with the plastic wrap off of it. You can see some of the featured Pokemon. As a collector, I definitely prefer the Breakpoint set over Breakthrough. Both sets actually have pretty good cards for the competitive scene for another couple of weeks or so. 36 total booster packs in this booster box. We'll open up 18 in part one, 18 in part two. Start with the right stack of packs first. Would really like to pull out the Skyla Full Art Trainer from the set. You can also get a Gyarados EX Full Art Secret Rare, one that has some gold borders to it. Mega Scizor on the cover artwork design of the first pack. This is the first set to include two different versions of the code cards. It helps prevent pack weighing, but also gives away if you're going to get something good in that final spot, the rare spot. Three and two is the card trick. The very first pack in this box starts with Ducklet, Furfru, Psyduck, Gibble, Scorpy, Pseudo Widow, an excellent card, really good against something like Zoroark GX, Bayleaf, Max Potion, Reverse Solo of a Clefairy, just a common, and the rare here would be a Pangoro. Next pack here. Phantom to start the pack. Psyduck, Shelder, Blitzel, Pharaoh Seed, Cricketune, Luxio, Durant, Reverse Hollow of a Luxray, there we go, Rare Reverse Hollow, and the final card would be a Hypno. Of course, this is not only an XY series set, but a Break series set, so there are Break cards in the set, they come in the Reverse Hollow slot of the pack. Luxray break on the cover artwork here. White colored code card, TCGO after the Pokemon.com URL. That indicates at least a rare hollow in the pack. Espeon EX, an excellent card for the competitive scene. Blitzel to start the pack. Staryu, free retreat cost on this one. Esper, Pharaoh Seed, Electabuzz, Luxio, Palpitoad. Potion, Reverse Hollow of a Meow Stick, there we go, another rare Reverse Hollow, and the final card would be a Togekiss EX, so an ultra rare here, not one that is used very often, but as a collector, very happy to add ultra rares and secret rares to my collection. I'll summarize my pulls, of course, at the end of this video, if you're short on time, just want to skip ahead, take a look at the code here, Trubbish to start this pack. Garbodor from this set, very good, turns off abilities. Phantom, Esper, Ducklet, Furfru, Puzzle of Time, another good trainer card. You can play two of these at the same time and retrieve two cards from your discard pile and put them into your hand. Nuzleaf, Reverse Solo after this Mawile would be. There we go, a Greninja Break, the break card that I wanted most from this opening. Giant Water Shuriken can spread damage from your bench. You can use this card, its ability. So you can almost knock out any of your opponent's Pokemon in play with a couple of Greninja Break on your side. And then the final card would be a Goldock. Back to a Mega Scizor pack. Electabuzz to start this one. Numel. Ratata. Petalil, Scorpy, Puzzle of Time, Arcanine, Palpitoad, Reverse Hollow of a Shinx, just a common, and the rare here would be a Clefable. 
I spent a lot of time digging through all of my cars trying to find Puzzle of Time trainers for some of the decks that I've built this past year. Pulled two out in the first few packs here. As of right now, I do not plan on playing the expanded format. I'll stick to the standard format, Sun and Moon base set and newer for the 2018-2019 season. C dot to start this pack. Temple, Trubbish, Phantom, Esper, Electivire, Psychic's Third Eye, Dunsparce, Reverse Solo of a Deblade, which is an uncommon, and the rare here would be an Aegis Slash. And this is a rare holo, really stands out. You can really see it on camera. That is how I prefer the Holofoil cards to look. More similar to the original series of sets. Luxray Break Pack. First card here is Ducklet, Glammeow, Spritzy, Shinx, Slowpoke, Professor Sycamore, a very good supporter card, Gyarados Spirit Link, Aromatissi, Reverse Solo of a Scizor Spirit Link, which is an uncommon, and the rare here would be a Camerupt. Greninja Break Pack now. Glammeow to start, Spritzy, Shinx, Hone Edge, Pancham, Professor Sycamore, Misty's Determination, Swana, Reverse Solo of a Glammeow, just a common, and the rare here would be a Trevenant. Mega Scizor Pack. Overall from this box, I should be getting 12 combined, hollows, ultra rares, and secret rares. This, of course, could be a below average or an above average box. Froki to start the pack. Chikorita. Shelder. Dot, Timpole. Great Ball. Perugly. Bayleaf. Reverse Solo of a Petalil, just a common. And the rare here would be a Skyla, and this is a Full Art Trainer. I would say between this card and then Greninja Break, those were the two most wanted cards for me from this booster box opening. Skyla Full Art, an excellent supporter card. Set that one aside, and that may be the only Full Art that I get in this booster box, and it is the exact one that I was hoping for. And overall, in this summer's booster box opening series, I have had some pretty good pulls in my booster boxes. Next pack here. Star you to start this pack. Skrull. Cricketot. Drowsy. Growlithe. Gabite. Delinquent. Max Elixir, another good trainer card from the set. Trevenant would be the Reverse Hollow, that is a rare, and the final card would be a Clefable. About halfway through part one of this booster box opening, very happy with the pulls. If only this was last year, then a lot of these cards would be more useful going forward. Cricketot to start this pack. Numo, Shinx, Chikorita, Clefairy. Electivire, Splash Energy, another useful card in this set, Tierno, Reverse Solo of a Temple, just a common, and the rare here would be a Raticate. Next pack here, Spritzy to start the pack, Shinx, Hone Edge, Pancham, Blitzel, Puzzle of Time, Bursting Balloon, Durant, Reverse Hollow of a Pseudo Widow, another good card, pulled a couple of these now, this is an uncommon, and the final card would be a Ho-O-E-X. This card isn't particularly popular, but I am a big fan of Ho-O, a second generation Pokemon. Set that one aside, two regular EX pulls so far, Luxray Break Pack now. Clefairy, to start this pack, looks to be already knocked out. Froki, Chikorita, Shelder, Seedot, Heatmore, Great Ball, Reverse Valley, 
Reverse Hollow would be a Tierno, uncommon. And the final card here would be a Seismitoad. Greninja Break Pack now. Would really like to pull another full art card. No complaints at all though with that Skyla full art. Slowpoke to start this one. Glammeow. Spritzy. Shinx. Hone Edge. Cloyster. Frogadier. This is the Frogadier to use in any Greninja deck. Reverse Valley. Reverse Hollow would be a Furfru, just a common. And the final card would be a Zepstrika. With that Frogadier, you can quickly skip over Froakie and just put Frogadier right on your bench with that particular card. Mega Scizor pack now. Electabuzz to start the pack. Numel. Ratata. Petalil. Scorpy. Cloyster. Cricketoon, Stantler, Reverse Solo of C Dot, just a common, and the final card would be a Slow King, and this is a rare hollow. Another Hall of Foil pattern that really stands out. Do not mind that at all. Only two rare hollow pulls on the box so far. Three packs left to go in part one, then on to part two. Froki to start this pack. Petalil, Skrelp. Next up, Corsola, Rattata, Electivire, Durant, Pokemon Catcher, Reverse Solo, of Drowsy, just a common, and the rare would be a Meow Stick. Card that I pulled in Reverse Solo form earlier. Second to last pack now. Green colored code card, still could pull a break card out. Psyduck to start. Gibble. Scorpy. Slowpoke, Glammeow, Dunsparce, Heatmore, Fighting Fury Belt, an excellent item card, Reverse Solo, Slowbro, which is an uncommon, and the final card would be a Greninja, and this is the card that you pair with Greninja Break, of course Greninja Break goes on this card horizontally, just increases the HP of Greninja as well as gives it an ability. Final pack here in part one, and then I can summarize my pulls. White colored code card could end part one with some last pack magic here. So the final pack starts with Staryu, Skrelp, Krikatot, Drowsy, Growlithe, Pseudowido, Heatmore, Swana, Reverse Solo of a Potion, which is an uncommon, and the final card here would be a drag algae, and that is a rare hollow. So I can summarize my pulls now. In part one, I was able to pull out three rare reverse hollow, Trevenant, Meowstic, and Luxray, and then also three rare hollow, drag algae, slow king, and Aegislash. As far as ultra rares and secret rares go, I was able to pull out one break card in Greninja, the card that I was really hoping for. I was able to pull out two regular EX, Ho-Oh, and then Togekiss. And probably the best pull in part one would be the Skyla Full Art Trainer. So to summarize the pulls in part one again, I was able to pull out three rare reverse solo, three rare holo, one break card, two regular EX, and one full art trainer. So, so far, this is a pretty solid booster box. So there you have it. Thanks everyone for watching. As always, before you go, make sure to check out all the links in the description of this video, including links to my blog, Facebook, and Twitter pages. So thanks everyone for watching, and stay tuned for more videos. Thank you.